What's going on guys, it's Jho bringing you a brand new video and today Bungie dropped their latest blog update this week at Bungie and within it we finally got some more new information on the upcoming content update in the spring. So we finally got an official release date for this spring update and it's going to be coming in April so it's going to be referred to as the April update and the official date is April 12, 2016. So that's about a few weeks away, around a month or so and within it we're going to see new PvE challenges, new and updated gear, new quests featuring the Blighted Chalice Strike, increased max light and rewards, sandbox and crucible updates and more. So very exciting stuff, we finally got a confirmed release date and we also got some confirmed information on what's coming within it and we will also learn more within their Twitch streams. They're going to be streaming every Wednesday starting next week and they're going to reveal more about what's coming within this April update. So that's very exciting news. Also within the blog itself, the picture at the top kind of reveals a little bit of what we might expect from this content update. So if you look closely at the picture at the top featured on the article, uh, we see three guardians who look like they're taken or they could be wearing some taken armor. And also if you look closely, the armor pieces that they're wearing are some of the armor pieces that you could earn by completing Prison of Elders back when House of Wolves uh, came out and that was the main content for PvE. So we might have something involving Prison of Elders once again and we might get a newer version of it, maybe an updated version. I think it's pretty exciting especially because Prison of Elders wasn't as good of a, a PvE piece of content that everyone thought it was going to be. It kind of got a little bit stale really quickly and House of Wolves was mainly focused on Trials of Osiris after that so hopefully they can redeem themselves with this new April update with Prison of Elders if it has anything to do with that but um, it's pretty exciting hopefully they change it up a bit and make it more uh, replayable and more fun and uh, rewarding so that's pretty exciting also we're going to get some new gear and new weapons being added to the game so that's also exciting stuff. We got a new strike it looks like based on this new quest and the strike is called Blighted Chalice Strike. So within that strike we might get some more uh, strike exclusive gear as well. So that's pretty exciting stuff. New PvE stuff. But for the streams we have confirmed dates for what they're going to be showing and when it is. So first one is going to be on March 23rd Wednesday at 11 a.m. Pacific. And this one is going to be about the new things that we can do within this April update. So that's pretty good. The second one is going to be on Wednesday, March 30th at 11 a.m. Pacific once again. And it's going to talk about the new things we can earn. So some of the new rewards that we can acquire within this update. And then the last one is going to be on April 6th at 11 a.m. Pacific on another Wednesday. And uh, it's going to talk about sandbox and crucible updates. So that one's going to be mainly about crucible and uh, anything they're going to change, weapon balancing, stuff like that. Maybe matchmaking if it needs to be tweaked again but it's been a little bit better at least in my opinion I think matchmaking has definitely improved over the past month or so but anyways we got a lot of stuff to look forward to and then the week after that is going to be when the actual update drops so the next three Wednesdays is going to be pretty exciting we got more news about what's coming in this update and then after that we get the actual update itself so pretty exciting stuff I'll probably try to cover what they reveal within each of the streams and then we can talk about it and discuss what's new coming within this update so I'm really excited they finally gave us some more details and information on this upcoming update and it's pretty exciting I can't wait for new content it's been a while so uh, yeah it's really exciting stuff that's about it for this video though Thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you guys think about what's coming within this update. It seems like it could be something dealing with Prison of Elders based on that picture at the top. But let me know what you guys think. Let me know your guys' opinions. That's about it once again, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!